What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel and to another video. This is part six of the Rebuild the Box series. Removing everything in the truck. I've already actually cleaned up everything, all the stuff that I had, all my clothes and everything, everything that was on my bed, uh, except for the mattress. I didn't do anything with that yet. Um, got everything off the floor here. And so I have my a bunch of stuff here. And of course, everything is mainly on the passenger seat, all stacked up. You know, just in case uh, I have to drive anywhere, I can still use the uh, driver's seat. So start taking uh, some stuff apart. I think I'm going to start with all this stuff here, uh, the TV and the shelf uh, and all that stuff, the IV and the uh, LED lights, and uh, probably do something with the bed, uh, the mattress itself, and maybe remove this box. So yeah, let's get started. Now that I got everything off the wall here, I am actually going to work on taking this off, uh, which is actually the bed frame, so I gotta remove the mattress. I have to put it in the lower position because if you can see in here the little swivels, uh, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, you can see one of them right there. It's actually a bolt and a nut that I had to use. Two of them right there, and there's two of them right there. heavy just as much as that frame that this thing fits into as well and that is one of the main reasons why I am changing everything in the back of the truck just to make it a lot lighter because this thing is a lot of weight all right so now that the bed the box that the bed sits in is removed and out of the box frame right yeah anyway I still have the uh, swivels connected which I don't have to remove those they can stay with those boards it doesn't really matter I'm not trying to I'm not reusing them anyway so the next step is to take apart uh, this back wall here so I guess we're gonna go to the back of the truck to the basement and clean that out so we can get this back part off so that we can have access to, out the back I'm gonna clear all this stuff out that's uh, stuffed in here and then remove uh, all this insulation, this foam board insulation. I'm uh, probably gonna reuse that at some part in this build, but for now I'm just gonna reuse, uh, remove it so that I can remove what's behind it, which is all that plywood. And that's the thing, that's what's separating the outside from the inside. So I kind of forgot how I had put this together and actually screwed this uh, plywood onto the inside frame. I think we have to head inside and unscrew it from the sides and then unlodge it from this so I can have more room to get the uh, plywood out. And that is exactly what I had done. So you can see right here, all these screws, I have to remove them and then I have to come over here and I have to remove those screws as well. 
uh, up in there and up in there. Well, I got all the screws out as far as I could tell, but that thing is not budging. So I'm thinking I'm going to try to unwedge this piece here from in between this black box here and then and the frame because I that's what I did. I put that in the frame in first, and then I centered the black box and then framed everything else around it and then shoved this plywood in between. So I'm going to try to take that off first. Maybe that's binding it up. this thing out, let's go to the other side and get this plywood off. Most of it's done, let's finish up and uh, get the rest of this stuff out including this big black box here and uh, the rest of the framing from uh, the original stuff that was in here. Let's go. So now I just got to clean up this mess and then the last thing that I'm going to do to take everything out of the uh, out of the truck here is remove all this white paneling because I have new white paneling to put up but I also have a surprise but you're going to have to wait and see. All right, so now that we have everything out from the back of the box, the next thing we're gonna do is remove this ceiling.
check it out, everybody. I finally got the ceiling out of this thing, and as well as all of this stuff here. So now we have a fresh, clean canvas for our build. But unfortunately, that's all the time we have for today. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on the next video of the Rebuild the Box series. With all that being said, thank you so much for all the love and support. Don't forget to drop your thoughts and comments down below. And I'll see you next time. Going for a car ride.